this water sled up last year. We mobbed it like twice. And for some reason I was the only one who could actually like successfully do it. To all of our surprise. Yeah, being I'm like literally the least snowmobiler in the group besides Ken, I suppose. But anyways, this thing's only got like a 20 foot rope on it and I was water skipping across like 60 feet of water. So if something would have gone wrong, I would have sank. We, we could have probably recovered it, but we would have needed like a scuba diving team and like the whole nine. So anyways, today we're gonna fix that. We got a longer rope and then a bigger canister we're gonna be putting on just so that way it can hold it. And then uh, these guys are gonna be trying to join me yeah. in the water skipping of our lake. Roughly right there is where we're gonna cut. If found, please do not re Cycle. I am a cat. I fucked that up. The one T attached I don't to <laughs> a snowmobile. They're gonna read it and be like, I don't even know what that says, but we gotta get this in the garbage. <laughs> Cut the rope that it's connected to. It can't be tied to anything good. <laughs> Loves pit biking more than anyone I know. Yeah. Money Mike, that's his name now. He's doing that shit with his hands. You look like you belong on the streets of Philly. With the light jacket on? Well, I mean, not really the look, but the way you were riding. Howdy. Thanks. Guess fishing? Yeah. I would consider it more jet skiing. Jet skiing. Funds are tight this year. All right, bud. You set the bar really high last time on yourself, really, so let's hope you don't uh, disappoint. Jeez. If you sink it in like 12 feet, we'll figure it out. If you sink it in the middle, we we probably won't figure it out.
He makes me nervous when he almost sings it twice and just keeps going. I never thought I'd be saying this, but I think CJ might be the snowmobile goat. How is he so good at that? If I had a hat on right now, I'd be tipping it to him. He's like literally hanging on it. Yeah. Like the bars were like this. He's sank it there i'm not gonna lie that was the that, hardest bar hump of 2021 straight up you saved it that was a little too close for comfort i'll tell you that dude <laughs> I thought you were going we all we all did we're like yep frick. i was like here it goes I, that I, was I played with fire for too long all right boys we're going redemption ken what's up what do you think what's the over under just lean you forward know, normally i would say we're 100 gonna sink it but i got faith in you thanks bro this might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me I think we should <laughs> Let's do that again. You yeah. could risk it going just as bad. <laughs> That's true. I dude. think you'll be fine. Do we want to risk it? I think you'll be fine. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Alright, one more. I got your cheddar. You're gonna do great. Thanks, bro. You're gonna do good things. That's how they depart the astronauts before Jeff Bezos went great. Into, state, uh, into space. He had his Ken stand in there, just daps him up. This is what would happen if you dapped up Jeff Bezos. No! <laughs> Hell yes. <laughs> Hell yes! <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Wow, I'm so glad you were just totally in on that joke with me. Like, you knew exactly what I was gonna do. <laughs> Alright, so what now? You start like this? Or how All do right. you start? When you start off, you're literally just, you're gonna wanna have one foot forward and then this foot back. The more yeah. your weight wants to be forward because you're too far back, it's gonna start bouncing. Right. So you're gonna take off. If you pin it off the start, it will literally Flip do over. a wheelie, Got probably it. over backwards. Okay. Um, so just kind of ease into it. Like, I mean, not easy, easy, but give her some juice, but not all of it. Okay. Yeah. Then once you hit the water, Half since we have juice. a little bit of a shorter run up right now, a little bit, and we have to go straight on because that pink swan. You're gonna basically probably pin it. If, if, if you feel water? like if you feel like it's slowing down, give it more gas. Okay. And lean forward while you're giving it more gas because if you lean back while you're giving it more gas, it's gonna like wheelie like what was happening to me out there. Oh yeah. So just, you can't really have too much weight forward. I never thought yeah, I'd be taking snowmobile tips from CJ. Nothing against you. I just never thought, you know. Hey man, I'm the water skip guy, I guess. You are, you are the go-to water guy. There's no possible way I could mess this up. There is so many ways. I know there's so many ways. You know, I wasn't nervous. Well, I was, I'd be, no, I was lying. That was just a blatant lie. I've been nervous and now I'm just more nervous. Can you sure you don't want to do this? Yeah, I'm, I'm sure. It's super shallow in here where Ben's taking off from, so if he gets going, we're not gonna be able to catch up to him. We're gonna meet him out here. I'm a little nervous. I can tell Ben's nervous. That's because before we were, we did this, we were just playing around. Now he's like, well, I gotta do the lake, right. otherwise it's gonna look dumb. The worst part is when you're sitting there waiting for everyone else to get ready, and you're just like, idling. That's my bag, so I gotta kick it out, that's my bag. Try to mess with my money, wanna try that. Pray to real live on fake die bags, and I slap bags, that's right. You know I mean, oh, the sting bell! Right. I'm the reason why your girl left, that's right. Boys. I was so rattled because of the milk jug, and then I started Holy getting frick. swirly, like I started jumping. You almost wheelied out of it. I know, bro! What kind of bouncy ass shit was that? <laughs> How deep is it? Uh, like 15. Are you serious? <laughs> How deep can you dive? Are you serious? Yeah. <laughs> can't even see it down there, dude. 16 now. I'm so glad <laughs> I didn't do this. Oh my god. Tummy zone, dude. <laughs> you got a little bit of weeds on your face. Yeah, I guess sand in my mouth. First off, wow, my bad. 
second off, I have no idea how you rode out of that. As soon as it starts jumping, your, your yeah. instinct is just to grab the it's throttle like riding a and bowl. it wouldn't stop. It's like riding a pole. You do the same exact thing CJ did, but just so much squirrely. Did you pull the cord so it didn't suck up too much water? I mean, I it's, it's 15 feet under right. It's not. I saw you pull it. I, all I saw was no, you No, I pulled like the this. cord. Okay, thank God. I'm surprised you managed to do that, honestly. I, you had it, and then you got a little squirrely, and then I was like, oh, he's got it, and then you didn't like, have it, and then next thing I know, you were swimming. Man, yeah, this is embarrassing. I'm not Sorry. even worried about that. I'm just worried about how we're going to get this out. Tying yeah. it up to the boat? Like, literally, what do we do? All right, somebody grab the goggles. This will actually be kind of sick. Right. We've got all the proper equipment for this. Ben, uh, you are so lucky that you didn't sink it in like 60 feet of water, because then I don't know what, we'd have to call a scuba team. Um, How heavy do you think this thing's gonna be under the water? Are things lighter under the water they're or heavier? They're, they're lighter. lighter. Well, I mean, Dumb every day. They weigh the same, it's just, it's displaced by water. What? It, it still weighs a snowmobile weight. Ken's just trying to act all smart on you. It's light underwater. I got it. Oh, oh, it's got it's it. heavy. It's heavy. I see a little bit of green. I mean, the whole lake is green. No, like Articat green. Yeah. Uh, I hate swimming. I'm, so I'm a terrible swimmer too. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, this sucks. The GoPro on the back is still filming too, I think. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, it definitely is. <laughs> How is it? It's down there. Oh, out there. <laughs> is it scary? <laughs> yeah, it's scary. Well, I kind of want to check it out. Diving super deep, you start to get your nerves up and then you breathe. Yeah. It's dark down I there. I breathe down there with like half a breath of air. Okay, one more. Ready? Three, two. You know, some people just aren't meant for the water skipping life. They need to stick to snow. We suck ass at holding our breath. Yeah, you did. You're down there for like two <laughs> seconds. Oh, fuck, I'm such a bad swimmer. My parents should not have taken me out of swimming lessons at these goggles. Level actually, three. I you shouldn't have sank it. Oh, man. I suck ass at swimming too, though. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> look at me. Neither of us. You look good. <laughs> I can see how this would be scary. I'm already kind of scared. <laughs> <laughs> you, you guys want to show Fear Factor? <laughs> what? <laughs> when did he become such a pro? Ken, you want to get in here and try? I'm, I'm right. more than good. I almost drowned at like my first day of swimming last night. Like, <laughs> I've been scared. No, I'm dead serious. I didn't finish. It was that was I went then and that was it. For some reason, I just weighed out all the options of this ever thing. I was like, nah. That won't happen. We're on our favorite lake in Mexico. Everything is sealed though, so no like oil or gas is getting into the lake. Literally a, a dude filling up his boat at the end of his dock probably spills more gas than that thing could even hold. Did you get it? I didn't see yeah. it on both, dude. No both way. Both. Ryan had the <laughs> Let's go, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan had the thing loop before I could even blink my eyes. Dude, I went down, I have bad ears, and my head being at the bottom versus- that hurt, oh yeah. Versus my feet being at the bottom, I literally felt my ears go Oh. <laughs> that kinda hurts. Yeah. Oh, dude, we got this. Oh, hold on, Are you getting hold this? up, we're pulling this up. All right, we're good, we're good. Keep going. Wrap the rope around like your leg or something. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, oh. We're getting so close, we're almost there, you guys. Just keep doing exactly this speed. We're making waves. <laughs> you guys are like chilling and Ken's like, I'm losing this thing. Come on, Ken. I'm actually, all right, stop, right, stop. We're almost home. Oh, there she's she almost is. capsizing out of the water. And that is how you successfully cover a sunken snowmobile. If this is your guys' first time watching one of our videos, make sure you subscribe. All right, we're good. Bye. Right. And if you guys are feeling really generous, you know, you could go and buy some merch. Oh, merch. I think these hats just dropped. Oh. Dope, too. Ken, give him a tug. We don't call Ken Tug Tug for nothing. All right, or at all. Well, how many poles do you think till it starts? <laughs> Dude. So many. TJ just hits you with that. I thought she might have been gone. Glad that one's over. Look at that. Still a full tank of gas.
got her. To the shop. Let's go drain this thing out and hope it starts. I did not want to do that, but. I did not want to either. It had to happen. All right, we're gonna tip this thing outside, try draining it all out. Should we just like leave it for a month? No. And then think about running Bad it again? Idea. Oh man, you'd have to be a real dummy zone to do that to a vehicle. Panel. I'll pan, pan over the disassembled engine. We'll let Ryan tell that story. It's a whole lot of boneless ice. <laughs> it seems dry. The last time we did this, water was like coming out of the cylinders. Yeah, so maybe you killed it just in time. Let's put it back together and just put some fuel in it and see what happens. Is there fuel going through or no? No way! She's golden. I don't think we have anything left for you guys today. Thank you guys so much. Bucket hats and straw hats are now live, so pick That's them right. up. Little mini drop. And also, new podcast is live. We interviewed Ken this week. Basically, Ken did his tell-all. He really got deep, shed some tears. <laughs> we shed some tears. His real name. His real name, yeah. and also why he always says no. So go check that out. We're gonna have it linked down below. Thank you guys so much. We will see you next time.